our son, Omer Yutra, was born and raised here. He was born in Manhattan, raised on Long Island, within the Jewish community and the Israeli communities. His values were peace and love and support. Upon finishing his school, he decided to do a gap year in Israel and then decided to join the Israeli army to defend the countries, the country that his grandparents helped establish. My kid, 19 years old, is also being held hostage by the Hamas. But we are here not only talking about ourselves, we're here representing 220 families of kids, Holocaust survivors, women being held hostage. We feel and believe and wish all of you to think that these are crimes against humanity. The minimum requirements of having any type of visitation of these hostages, knowing if they're dead or alive, getting medical attention. There are doctors at the border, if you know that organization, waiting to get in. Somebody is not letting them get in. I'll give you a guess who it might be. I urge each and every one of you to think as a parent, brother, grand, grandson, grandchild, what would you do? We will tell you 18 days, you don't know if that loved one is alive, dead, getting fed where he slept. The presentation uh, behind us represents 220 families. 220 families that can't sleep at night because they don't know what's the status of their kids, their parents, their babies.